Every day, Be Well Philly uncovers the stories of Philadelphians who are making a positive, healthy change in their communities. That's why we love the Health Hero Challenge, because it allows us to go a step further and give back to the organizations that are doing this important work. The Health Hero Challenge is different because it's really recognizing those unsung heroes in our community. So to give them that recognition and publicity and then the winning donation really will make a difference for these organizations. This year, we have three amazing finalists. Amanda Piccarelli Hall is the Southeast Pennsylvania Ambassador for Ainsley's Angels of America, which pairs those with physical disabilities with able-bodied athletes to ensure that they can compete in endurance races across the country. The mission goes beyond yourself. It's about giving back, it's about community, it's about allowing others to experience the joy that you get to experience in your health journey. And that's what I adore that I get to do. I get to include people who would usually be on the sidelines and we get to help put them over finish lines. Caitlin Thompson started the Philadelphia chapter of Little Bellas, a nationwide organization that helps young girls build self-confidence through mountain biking. I wanna be a role model to help girls gain confidence we show them not only how to ride their bike in the woods, but how to be amazing humans, supporting each other and lifting each other up. Anne Wendell founded PreserveFertility.org, a nonprofit that raises funds to help those diagnosed with cancer preserve their fertility. No patient having just received a devastating diagnosis of cancer should have to forego their dream of having a family simultaneously. The success stories are what makes it all so special. We are really excited about this award this year. We are giving out $15,000 to the winner, which is the largest award that has ever been given, and will do so much for the organizations that we recognize. If Ainsley's Angels won the Health Hero Award, we'd be able to buy new chairs, add them to our fleet. We have more riders rolling, more opportunities for people who wouldn't have that chance. We try very hard to raise money to provide scholarships and to provide loaner bikes. And if we can win the $15,000, we would be able to provide even more girls that opportunity. Winning this challenge would make such a change to our organization because we could begin offering grants to patients for their fertility preservation. Thank you to everyone who was involved in the Health Hero Challenge this year. It's really clear that we are a community that cares about health. Independence Blue Cross would like to congratulate our semi-finalists, finalists, and obviously our Health Hero winner. And we'd also like to thank all of you for casting your votes and helping us recognize what these individuals have done in our communities. Congratulations to the winner of this year's Health Hero Challenge.